I really enjoyed Love on the Sidelines. This was released in 2015. It's directed by Terry Ingram and written by Sandra Burke and Judith Burke. And it stars Emily Kinney as Laurel and John Reardon as Danny. And I wasn't sure how much I'd love this because it's partly about football. It's not really about football, but I don't care about football. But we had maybe one or two scenes of actual football and really not much more than that. So if, like me, you've kind of been hesitant about this because you're worried it's going to be very heavily about football, it really isn't. Laurel is taking on a job as a personal assistant and she becomes Danny's personal assistant and he, he's had a an injury to his ankle, so he, he's unable to play. He's on the sidelines, of course, there's the title. And initially he was not happy with the arrangement because he wanted a guy, somebody, you know, who could go in with the the locker rooms with him and be there for him 24-7 rather than, you know, areas where Laurel perhaps couldn't go. But since he's not playing at the moment, he agrees that Laurel can be his personal assistant until he gets back on his feet. And obviously, as the film progresses, they grow together, their relationship is... Well, I was going to say the relationship blossoms, but that's too strong a word for what happens in most of the film. But there is this constant spark and Danny does soften to Laurel quite quickly, actually, but then he begins to soften more and more. So the romantic aspect feels very believable because they spend a lot of time together. But Danny is also currently dating a model, not a very likable character. To be honest, though, the only reason she's not very likable is because she's not very good with dogs, which sounds like a stupid reason. But I think when you watch the film, you'll know exactly what I mean. And obviously, Laurel doesn't want to be unprofessional. So there is a spark, but neither of them are willing to ignite it further than it already is. So it's definitely very interesting to watch that try and grow while both of them try and prevent it. It's it's very well done. And Yes, there's a decent amount of football references and terminology, most of which I didn't understand, but not so much that I felt like I was watching a football film. It was definitely just uh, a premise around which the the rest of the narrative, the romantic aspect, could grow and develop. So I really enjoyed it. The performances were great. Both Danny and Laurel were really likable. I wasn't sure if I'd like Danny to begin with because he was quite rude to Laurel. But actually, after the first time we meet him, I I took to him again and I I really enjoyed it. If you like rom-coms, then it's it's definitely one that I, I recommend. I had a lot of fun with it. I was emotionally invested in the characters' journeys. I believed it. It felt very realistic. And I have absolutely no complaints. Love on the sidelines is definitely one I enjoyed and one I'm very happy to recommend.